What's up my fellow gamers? Today I'm going to show you how to easily defeat Bloodhound Knight Darewill and earn my favorite weapon in the game, the Bloodhound Fang. This will be easy because we're going to have some help from our new friend Blade. First we're going to be heading to the Mistwood Ruins. I tried to speed up the video for you guys so that way we don't waste any time. We're going to start by that gate front and head over this bridge, grab that smithing stone, and keep traveling down. We kind of travel a little south and then we're going to eventually turn and head east right here. There's multiple routes to get over to the ruins. Uh, hopefully you've already kind of discovered them, but I kind of put them on that map right there so you kind of can see where we're going. Okay, so once we get over to these ruins, we're going to try to make sure that we run around a little bit. You're going to be hearing a howl, and that howl is going to be Blade. He's going to be howling for uh, letting you know he's over there. Then you're going to head back over here to the church, talk to the Mr. Snowy Man guy. He's going to give you a gesture called Finger Snap. From there, we have to run all the way back to the ruins. So I try to speed that up as much as possible. Once we get to the ruins, then we're going to be going to talk to Blade. At this point, you're going to want to make sure you use that finger snap. Blade's going to jump down. We're going to talk to him for a little bit. Now we got to run all the way down to go fight Darawil. And he is south of the uh, starting area where the first step is. So we're just running there real quick. Make sure to get that grace along the way. Don't forget those. All right, so this is important. Once you get over here, we're going to be just heading on in. And when you get in there, you're going to want to summon Blade. And he's going to do all the fighting for you. So let him fight. Uh, as you can see, I was taking some hits here because I was being greedy. Don't be greedy. It's really not worth it. So you can see he almost gets me. Um, not my proudest moment. Just let Blade do the fighting, especially when you're really low level. So once Blade takes him out, then we are good to go. And we'll have our Bloodhound Fang. There it is. Hope this guide helped you guys. If you enjoyed the video, please drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much.